Welcome back cat babes to another tutorial here on my channel. I am so sorry it has been it's been a really long time. A lot a lot of things have been going on in my personal life with family, work and things like that. Um and right now it feels like it's pretty much calmed down a little bit, but with that being said, um, I hope you guys enjoy enjoy today's tutorial and let me know if you want me to keep doing them. Hi cat babes. So I decided that with me getting a promotion at work, um, I went through um, the assistant manager interview program at my job and I am happy to announce that I was selected and I will be starting um, the 31st of August as an assistant manager. I will be doing about five weeks of training, um, give or take. So it's going to be very, very busy and very hectic. So I'm hoping that um, I will still be able to make videos for Halloween and things like that because of being an assistant manager working for Walmart. Um, they are all about the holidays and you basically become a Walmart zombie because you have to take care of the customer. So I'm going to try and when I'm off, I'm going to like double on videos that way you can get them uploaded for you guys but I thought I deserved these two subscriptions that I subscribed to. The first one that I did was Lashy Box. Isn't it so cute? This little box is the most cutest little thing ever. Um, this one there are um, four. You have the mini, this one, um, a deluxe one I think and one other one. I, I went with this one because it gives you a variety. The other ones kind of are geared towards uh, one like type and I figured this was perfect for me. So in this lovely little box comes all of these lovely little goodies. So the first pair of lashes are called Glam. These ones are 3D silk lashes, and these ones are by Lashy Box and Silk. And then the second pair is 3D silk tailor lashes. Um, these are by Lashy Box as well. And then this set is 3D foam ink lashes um, by Secret Garden. Aren't they pretty? And then I got this Naked Cosmetics Mother Nature shadow so pretty and then i got this cutest little lollipop it's a secret garden it's called tulip aren't they cute i just want to sit there and do this and then it came with a appeal gel liner in the forest green color shade and then it came with the lashy box strip lash adhesive glue for the lash so for $13.99, you get all of those goodies in that box, which is amazing. And then I got suckered into this one because they had a really good catch get you. But I subscribed for BoxyCharm as well. With this one, I got two extra free gifts in this one for signing up. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. And this is how much is in this one. Wham! Okay, so it comes with like the little paper that tells you how much they are. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna tell you how much they are as well as who they are by and um, their name. So, this is the Luxie Gaia three-piece brush set. Um, it sells for $30 wholesale. And they look, they come in this weird little package. They look like this. They're hardwood. Like really hard. But they are super soft. So you have um, 
a foundation brush, um, a Luxie 250 large eye blending brush, and a Luxie 246 precise precision brush. So that is the brushes, and they're really pretty. All right, so that is that. The next is gonna be the Butter London Natural Goddess Eyeshadow Palette, and it looks like this. I love this shade and this shade. So you've got um, Femine Fatale, Temptress, Diva, Star, Queen, and Enchantress. I think these would be a great like little night out on the town like shades just because they're like, they're like out there for you, but they're also like holding it back. But these two for sure would be great together with this like on top in, in the inner corner. And this retails for $32. Okay. The next one is the Becca Hydra, Hydra Mist and Refresh Powder. This one retails for $39. And it comes and it looks like this. It's so pretty. Look, do a chrome. But my sister wanted to fill it, so we opened it. But this is really cool. So you can't. You can't use the powder because you want to keep it cool. You have to open the little thing. And it has like a little sifting thing at the top. So literally you sift it onto your brush or your beauty blender. And it's really like, really like cool to the touch, which is really cool. Um, I'm going to be doing a look with it in this video as well because I want to do a look for you guys. So we're going to keep it out of the box. And then the next is the um, brand called Wander. It's a glow ahead illuminating oil. This retails for $42 and it's pink. I tried it the other night just because I wanted to see if it would do anything, but it's like a pink glitter. So when you rub it into your face, it makes your face really like illuminated, but the glitter doesn't, doesn't stay. Does that make sense? Like I have, um, the Wet n Wild Dewy one, and it's really glittery. glittery. Wow, can't talk. And I don't like that one. But I love Wet n Wild stuff, so it's kind of odd that I didn't like that one. But it's way, 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 way too glittery for me. The next is the Tarte Big Ego Mascara. It looks like this. Um, I'm just excited. And it's in a big ass pink tube. Ooh, look at that brush. Woo! We are gonna play with this stuff, okay? We are gonna play with this stuff. Leaving it out of the box. The next is the Ace Beauty Glimmer Shadow Duos. I believe they both a piece retail 25 bucks a piece or they're $25 together. But you have the shade called Huckleberry and this shade called French Vanilla and I think they're beautiful. Everyone says it reminds them of the ColourPop little things that you can buy. I don't have any but you never know. The last thing in the box is the Hollywood In Vine Velvet Touch Smooth Coal Eyeliner in the shade Black <clears throat> and this retails for $7. So, all my little goodies I couldn't be happier with. I was super, super, super excited to get both of these. I was waiting for the one to come in so that I could do a video and all of that. But, without further ado, now that you've seen everything, let's jump into trying on the products. Okay, cat babe. So the first thing we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna jump in with the Wonder Glow Ahead Illuminating Face Oil. We're just gonna plop a little bit on the forehead, on the cheeks. You see how pink it is? Pink! Okay, get the hair out of the face. I have a cut on my finger, so I'm trying not to like put anything in it. You see how it makes your face shiny? I love it. Sweet. And 
makes your face look like it's awake versus being dead. So there's that. And then going in with the Milani Conceal and Perfect Foundation in the shade 02 Natural. We're just going to go ahead and put that in strips across our face. I know I usually skip through this, but I know I haven't done a video in a hot minute. So we're going to, we're just going to go with it. All right. So now that we have that part done, we're going to go ahead and take that same beauty blender and we're going to put it in the Becca Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. We're just going to go like this. And it does have a sifter, so it makes it kind of hard to uh, get a ton of product on. Oh boy, that, <clears throat> that is cold. Or maybe it's just my sponge. But it feels cold, guys. London in the color sandstorm my go-to cutting powder We're gonna leave that there and we're gonna go ahead and do our eyes just so that way we have that part done. So we're gonna go ahead in with that Butter London pow powder um, palette. We're gonna go ahead and pick up the Jaclyn Hill Morphe 31 brush. We're just gonna pick up that brown shade and yes, it's pretty dark so be careful. want to continue to blend because the shade is really pigmented and dark. Oh, Morphe E19 brush and we're going to pick up that Femin Fatel blue shade. Ooh, we're going we're gonna to go in, honey. We're going to go in. And go just a little bit on the brim. Because you can see it. And then we're going to pick up that Luxie Precision Crease Brush. And then we're going to go ahead and pick up the shade called Diva. It's like a gold shimmer. Ooh, is it pigmented? We're going to have problems with this. Go in with the brown shadow that you still have left on the brush and go ahead and put a little under your under eye. Because you don't want it to be like crazy crazy, or at least I don't underneath there. And we're going to go in with an eyelash curler. And then go in with that mascara. It's got a really nice. Uh... This is the final look using my two new um, subscription boxes that I will be getting each month. So if you guys would like for me to do a monthly review on my boxes, give me a thumbs up, a comment below, and if you have not already, please subscribe to my little cat family that is growing 
We are almost at 400, guys. It's amazing. Um, I know I'm forgetting my lips. I know. Hi. Hold on. Okay. Let's do this. This is the Victoria's Secret Halo Glow Lip Gloss. And that's the final look, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in my next one. Bye, guys.